Hello, dear founder. Today, I want to give you very interesting stuff. You definitely know that modern world depends on trends. You can earn money on trends, you can configure your business based on trends, you can change behavior based on trends. And when you know about it, it's your competitor advantage. But recently I thought, okay, I'm an entrepreneur. I don't have so much time to follow it. What I can do? And a brilliant idea came to my mind, especially that I have knowledge, knowledge about um, building AI chatbots to create AI agents that will not only scrap the world trends from the internet, but also will create some content based on these trends. Uh, so we today will move through this bot and I will discuss details, how it's work and a lot of hidden details. So not ev so everything not simple as you think. It's not just a few clicks and that's it. Uh, again, you can see on the screen, we will use N8N for uh, building our bot and few other external APIs. Uh, so let's move to overview this. Uh, the main idea, first I want to give you some show how this works. So I want to past uh, oh, my, my main idea, I want to create some content for a reel. Yes, and pass this content, content inside a air table. So you can see there is uh, my um, like deprecated data that I used for a test. And let's run our bot. You can see there this column is empty, so let's move forward. I am running testing bot, it's moving and it will fill for now few new tracks. So uh, you can see that today it's uh, 27 of uh, February 2025 and we already have number one trend for United States, it's Mich Michelle Trachtenberg. Unfortunately, she died, yes, um, and ChatGPT, oh my god, okay, it's not GP, ChatGPT, it's a uh, Gemini Open AI, but Gemini model, but it uh, creates this uh, content. Again, Gossip Girl, it's about here, it's trying number three, number two, and we can recheck that it's work properly, we just need to go to the Google Trends and we see first one, second one, right now it will, yeah, uh, it pass uh, the third trend for United States missiles, but again, don't know what is this. We can see that, yeah, suddenly something we can check focus or urgency. Missiles is back and it's scary. Yeah, we uh, have some limitations there, so um, you can see that already four trends have been scrapped. But if we extend our APIs, we can scrap even more, more, and more up through even 100 trends. So, how it's going on, how it's more. Uh, the main stuff, we first to use schedule trigger. Mm, we can again make it by a press button, doesn't matter. For, for me, I configure that it should uh, fulfill each day. The next step, we need to scrap all Google Trends that happened today. Yes, um, and there is a first issue. Google Trends doesn't have API. I don't know why, uh, because uh, there's a lot of reasons they described, uh, but the main stuff is that we need to use external provider to fulfill this gap. And I'm using this one, Search AP. Um, they have very wonderful API, uh, how you can use like um, a lot of configures. Uh, you need to use exactly this stuff, uh, geolocation, timeline, I use past 24 hours AP key, and yes, it returns the data, for example, if I test it right now, I sending something like this and receive um, such amount of trends. As you can see, based on these trends, uh, you can find like the main ones, but what is the most important for us? It's uh, this column. See, position one, uh, first one, then uh, there's a lot of additional info about it. Position four, position five, and move, 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 move up to 100. Again, you can configure these trends. Right now, I'm scrubbing the most popular. You can configure it to scrub only IT trends or only news uh, trends or some other. Uh, as I mentioned, everything based on your needs. After this, what's going on next? We need to make some modifications. Uh, so there is a just, you know, um, we transfer data from uh, one array to another array uh, because ooh, this, this is a demand for uh, moving for a next step to receiving loop. Here we have loop, yes, for each. Uh, 
And uh, for this loop event, we saying for each trend, go to the um, some API model, yes, and scrub data about this model. And there is uh, again one big issue. Only one model can give you such advantage. It's a Google. Google Gemini. Why? Because uh, this model have access to the Google search. OpenAI doesn't provide it as a service. Uh, Grok3 doesn't provide it yet. DeepSeek, uh, again, uh, there is no possibilities. Only one provider that uh, can allow you to do this these days, it's a uh, Google uh, Gemini model, you can see. And furthermore, there is, again, very important stuff. Uh, like, I don't use um, AI agent here. I'm using just uh, post request. Yes, I sent post request for a generative language Google APIs.com. You can find it here. Um, yeah, there's uh, my uh, admin panel and etc. And you need to send not only get request for this endpoint, you need also to say that uh, good Google search should be included. Uh, I did it into this, uh, and also I sent a text, the text uh, JSON query. Uh, you can see that uh, I'm sending uh, what happened with Michelle Trashberg today, and it's returned me this text, I mean, what's going on exactly. So, not because here we see just uh, like a trench, um, like few words, yes. But what's going on under these few words? We receive exactly from this API. So, we send it, it uh, we receive this data, and based on this data, oh, like uh, they told that at the age of 39, she passed away, unfortunately, and uh, we need to feed this data for a next step. Again, next step, we configure a field, so uh, we are making this text a little bit uh, more prettified. So I fill in this text and we receive uh, this uh, chat input. Uh, we need this chat input, it's required to feed our agent on the next step. And on the next step, we creating this AI agent. We again using Gemini model. You can use this there, whatever you want. You can use ChatGPT. You can use uh, AWS, Meta, or some other language model. Doesn't matter. Uh, we feeding this text to him and writing a system manager that you are a content maker for reels. Based on provided data, write a content to create some reel for social media. Again, test step. We see this input and uh, we can find that it provides something like this again it could be configured it could be configured by some structure based on uh, your channel it's configured uh, with a quick byte uh, text uh, then we can configure it we are sending images uh, again and store these images based on uh, some other model like dali 2 and etc. The main fact is that we already received this uh, prompt, what's happened yesterday, and uh, we will uh, work with this one. The next step, we need to store this data somewhere. Uh, again, there is a few different possibilities. Um, you can use, for example, Telegram chatbot, yeah? I mean that uh, if you want to receive a daily like a notification, you can create a Telegram chatbot and uh, configure it as I did in the previous videos. Um, I personally made it as simple as I could with the Airtable. Why not Google Spreadsheet? Because uh, I don't want to spend my time to uh, make and work with their APIs. It's a little bit uh, complicated stuff. So I use Airtable. It's very easily. I just again will show you my configuration. There is a um, uh, record creation, uh, like everything is selecting from uh, this one. So, and I say just uh, inside the object put uh, item of a trend that you received on a loop stage. And as a result, please from uh, agents we already created, put this text info. That's it. And after this, we receive the next spreadsheet. That will, as you saw already, it will fill it automatically. There is uh, information, there is a uh, description. That's it. Objective description, objective description. If you want to configure it in another way, you are free to use, and this will give you automatically info about the old trends. What my opinion about this, how we can earn money with such stuff? I believe that in the next step, I will configure it and connect to the Eleven Labs and uh, with the Instagram, YouTube and uh, TikTok APIs. So I will create automatically content with uh, my face and this content will go to this public or receive some views because it's on a trend if Google, if 
people's services. It's definitely some topics. And uh, this will generate me some additional revenue. Again, this is not the best way and you know, I generally don't like a contract like this, but you got an idea and you can configure it for your business model. For example, if you want to uh, post some um, info into the news making channels, yes, for example, in Telegram, it's again a great possibility because it's what Again, we have a lot of uh, different um, possibilities here with the integrations. Um, that's it. Hope this video su suits you well. And if you need something like this, uh, but you don't have enough time or knowledge to to make configurations, uh, but you know that uh, very cool stuff can suit your business and increase your revenue, feel free to reach me out. My company provides these uh, services. So we'll be happy to be in touch with you and maybe we can make something together. It was your trustable chief executive officer. We'll see you.